In this video, I'm going to show you how to download your autoresponders from Get Response and stay till the end because I'm going to show you how you could avoid this possible painful task at a later date. So I'm the real Robin Williams. If you don't know me, let's get into it. And I'm going to start here just in case you don't know how to get to your autoresponders. So I'm at the Get Response home screen and all I have to do is click on tools and then click on autoresponders. From there, you want to choose the autoresponder sets that you want. So depending on what you see here, if you don't see what you want, you have your different list. So you want to pretty much either choose the one or choose all of them if you can't find your autoresponder. And then once you find the autoresponder that you want to download, you can click here and then click preview. Once okay. you click preview, it'll give you the email link preview that you can use, which is pretty cool. For, but essentially it's just a copy of your email. Now there's a couple ways you can do it. The first thing is to highlight the entire page, all of the text that you want, which is most likely the entire email email this is a long email but you want to highlight all it is once you highlight it you want to right click on the page and click print once you click print you'll see a save as PDF and as you can see I am grabbing all ten of those pages and pictures and things like that for some reason it's like an extra page in the front don't know why that's happening but it is what it is now for this you want to save it and it'll pull the name of your autoresponder which is pretty cool so you have less work and then you click download and then once it downloads you'll see that it actually actually saves your PDF and it has clickable links and things like that. So I'm just going to open this up real quick. You can see that you can click on those links and it'll open up. I don't need to open it up from here, but I just wanted to show you how good it is. All right. Now a quicker, a slightly quicker way to where you don't have to highlight everything is you can click on these three dots and then click on print from here. And as you can see, you have all of the pages without highlighting it, which is a little bit easier, just a tad bit and the same process you save it it'll keep the name and things like that I am going to show you the bonus area to where if later on if you're doing autoresponder work or writing emails for any autoresponder just your work period you want to save that work so I'm going to show you real quick how you can avoid having to go back and download your autoresponders and it's real simple you want to create a Google Drive account and you want to let me go to my folder you want to create a folder and create your emails straight from those folders so let's see I think this is the email that I created Created and I have all of my text in here and of course you can insert your pictures if you want as well to make sure you have every little thing you can add your links if you want but ultimately all of your emails will be there and it's a lot less headache if you have to scramble to download your autoresponder so you can find more business and marketing strategies and the platforms that I use to really elevate my business and start getting sales for my business you can find all of that information in the description below definitely like comment and subscribe and 